First off, I have to apologize. This is going to be a pretty advanced video on barcode scanning. Uh, we're going to get into creating project tasks in standard time automatically using a barcode scanner, uh, barcode labels, and RFID readers. The reason for that is that we use these project tasks to track time for employee jobs, uh, manufacturing, assembly line, shop floor, those sorts of things. But this video is pretty darn advanced because we're going to get into creating those project tasks. Now if you're not that far along, if you're just seeing this video for the first time, you don't know anything about standard time, you're just getting into tracking time with barcode labels, this video may be a little advanced. Keep the things you see in the back of your mind. You may bring them back later and realize that this, this is something that you want to do. But if you're already using standard time, you're tracking time, you're seeing the time that your employees are spending on jobs out on the shop floor, manufacturing, uh, just employee jobs. Um, if you're seeing those time segments that are captured by the barcode scanner or the RFID reader, uh, if you're already creating project tasks and tracking time to those tasks, then you're saying, yeah, this is awesome. This is the greatest thing on earth. This is everything I needed then you may be saying, okay, is there a way now that I can automate the process of creating those project tasks? If you're at that point, then let's take a look at the software here. This is the feature you want here. So let's go ahead and just uh, go into the software here and we'll take a look at how to create project tasks using a barcode scanner, RFID reader, and then we can track time to those tasks in standard time. So I've switched over to a little app called Barcode Builder, which is free with standard time. And normally, Barcode Builder is used to print barcode labels, which automatically creates the tasks at the same time. Those are sequential labels on Avery Sticky labels. But I'm going to use a different feature inside of Barcode Builder to allow me to scan barcode labels, which are already created from some other source, and create the project tasks for them. I'm going to go ahead and click on Create Tasks. Up pops this little window. And the first thing it wants is a project. So I'm going to go ahead and create one. I'll name it 87551. Click Create, you see it show up there, and then I can click in this field to begin scanning barcode labels, which will then create the tasks. Now it turns out that you can also create RFID records that can be used for an RFID reader, and that would want a username, and I can also go over here and delete tasks. So let's say I start creating those tasks at the beginning of the manufacturing cycle, the life cycle, the process, and then at the end, I just want to delete them. Uh, I can also delete the RFID record as well. Now these RFID records are actually barcode prefixes. You'll see that in another video. But if I click here, I will be creating two things, a project task and an RFID record, which is actually a barcode prefix record inside of Standard Time. I know that's pretty advanced, but you may see that in other videos or can ask about it. So I'll go ahead and click here and begin scanning. I've scanned one and it created a task. Scan again, and then a third one. Now I'll grab my little RFID reader. I've just scanned one card, proximity card, and employee badge. Scan again, so I've created those. Now let's switch over to standard time to see what happened. So I've switched over to standard time, and you can first of all see this project here in the, the employee timesheet, 87551. I click the plus symbol and I then see the five project tasks that were created using Barcode Builder. And you can see the three here uh, were the ones that I scanned with the barcode labels and the other two were from the employee proximity cards. Go over to the project tasks tab. Again, you see those same tasks here. They have zero durations right now, but you can fill in a duration if you want. You will also see actual work accumulate as you scan and time logs are added to the system. So go back to the timesheet. You can then press F4, 
scan the employee name and then one of these tasks and then you'll begin creating time logs so this is all automated there's nothing you have to do there's no uh, manual creation of tasks they are automatically created when you scan so very simple that's the barcode builder app that you can download and begin creating project tasks automatically.